So I'd ask that uh, no member interested in being seated from Senate District 45 please remove themselves from the roster. Senator Brewster is the certified winner of his district. Who's ready? If you wish, please place Mr. your Mr. left you hand on the Bible. Said and the judge will right cease. Hand. The judge will cease until we cannot swear anybody in until the gentleman from the 45th district removes himself from the roster. Mr. President, the chair has Mr. ruled. President, the chair has ruled since the results were not read. The results were read because I the read them, and they're part of the record because I read them. And the record is accurate. There, if there's anything that I read that was left out, intentionally cannot, left out, cannot proceed, then you should acknowledge that and tell how it was inappropriately proceed, left out. It was read, it was, appropriate, it was appropriate certification, and therefore he is, in fact, an appropriate place to be sworn in today. Thank you. The chair has ruled. Anyone has the right to appeal the chair's ruling if they so desire. But the chair has ruled. The we chair is behind you. We cannot proceed with any swearing in. We'll go on with the rest of our business without swearing anyone in, if that's the choice. You, Mr. President, uh, while I um, object to the manner in which we are conducting this process today significantly, uh, it is clear that all of us who love the institution of the Senate are uncomfortable in the manner that we're proceeding. But most significantly, the gentleman in question is uncomfortable, and he wants to make sure that those who are certified and are going to be sworn in whether they're Republicans or Democrats or a part of a group. And that group, he wants to make sure, enjoy the benefit of this day and proceed forward. So for those reasons, the gentleman has decided uh, to allow uh, the process to proceed without him. And we certainly want to respect him and the manner in which he's conducting himself.